So I've been working on the um, adapters since January with different various things, computer adapters which had power surges broke down, this TV adapter, and this is hitched up to this drill here, and here's the uh, TV adapter here. And when they don't have enough amps, it's a noisy morning, when they don't have enough amps, it has no power. This is five amps. So I talked to my friend Peter about amps and the uh, voltage, and he said you can go higher voltage, and it won't harm the drills. And I read my my um, adapter, and it was 14, so I tried it out. Now that's what I've been looking at in power, but you know, you can come along here and do this. See, there's one drill. And here's the second drill, right? What, what's surprising about that is one is 12 and one is 18 volt. So I've solved the problem with all the electrical. And here's another 12 volt that I was rigging up for something. So I've, I took a reading off this adapter, or you want to call it converter, this one here. And it said 14 point something. It's on 110 V. Now, this is working with 12 volts. Most likely works with 14 volts uh, drills and 14.5, whatever they are. And then with the 18 volt drills. So you've got it all in one with this model. It's an S-360-18 model HJ-1820. The input is 110 to 20 plus or minus 15, DC output 18 volt, 20 amps. So this solves all your problems with all your machines and drills. So at long last we have found something that works with everything and seems to do no harm at all. So I'm quite pleased. This is just a cap I put on to protect it and my legs fell off so I've got to put on another two legs here to keep the air flowing underneath. But when I see all these videos of people putting on converters and the drill doesn't go in through the wood, the reason is their model, adapter model, doesn't have enough amperage. Now, if you want to buy a converter and it's like a 10 amp, you might as well buy 20 amp because of how much you draw on the machine. It doesn't matter how much amps it has. So there's the lesson. And now we've got an adapter that does multi-purposing for all the drills that you'll find in all these thrift stores and sales. And so I will test it for quite a while and make sure nothing burns out or we have any problems. But in general, we have solved the problem. This is the 12 volt. And this is the 18 volt. So there you go. Now you can build these connectors into the unit as well like I did here. Right, I did one here, but you can get these screw-in connectors on eBay and you can screw them in. I'm just using these open green ones that I got on eBay as well. You can see them all over the place. There it is. I'm using them as connectors at the moment. And I'm just going to lift up the uh, converter and show you. There's the number. My feet, which came off my last working attempt. Uh, 110 and 220. So there you go. And this cap I put on to protect the cables and that.